In this video, I will be sharing with you a brand new innovative stamping product by Afrosec. Afrosec is a London-based company, but they do ship worldwide. Their stamps are very different to traditional stamps because you don't need fancy scrapers or polishes. One of Afrosec's brand mantras is it's not just nail art, it's art. This really caught my attention because that's a personal idea I strive to reflect in my videos, because I think nail art is a form of self-expression. And Hilla, the founder of the brand, feels the same way, having hand-designed all of the stamp images. The packaging of this product also reflects Hilla's attention to detail. Each stamp comes with a chic box like this, with the design of the stamp on the back, and has an easy open tab on the side. For the design I'm doing today, I'll be using three stamps. Stamp number three, which has geometric patterns. Stamp number 14, which is the wheel I was really inspired by and has hand-drawn Picasso style designs. And number five, which is an animal print themed wheel. The stamps also come with a step-by-step -step instruction booklet to guide you through the process. The overall instructions are on the front card, but then the following pages explain more in depth on what to do at each step. To begin the design, I'll be applying a white polish to three of my nails, which are going to be my Picasso-y abstract designs, and a complementary red and yellow polish on the others. Next, using the dry brush technique, I applied my primary colored polishes to the white nails to give a brush stroke effect. I also overlapped the polishes to create new shades. Make sure to let your base colors dry before moving on to stamping. As the instructions said, I applied polish to the image I wanted, then instead of using a scraper to remove the excess polish like you would with a traditional stamp, you just flip the stamp over and wipe the excess polish off on a piece of paper. If you have any bits of polish remaining around the image, just remove it with a toothpick. You can also remove specific parts of the design that you don't want. Let the image dry for a few seconds, then support your finger and firmly press the stamp onto your nail. If you need to, you can also remove the stamp from its plastic container. I did this to get into the sides of my nail. And you can easily clean off the stamps with nail polish remover and they're good as new. Next I'm using the abstract face from plate number 14. Again removing the excess polish on a piece of paper and any stragglers with a toothpick. It's very important to let the design dry for a few seconds or else it can smear when you transfer it onto your nail like you see here. Lastly, I'm using this little running man image and removing some of the detail to make it smaller. If your image sticks up a little after you transfer it, just carefully smooth it down with your finger. On my other nails, I used the triangle patterns on the tip of my nail to give sort of a gradient effect. Overall, I really liked these stamps. They're so innovative and fun to use. I love the fact that the designs are handmade and are different, but mainly I really like how easy these stamps are to use and the fact that you don't need special tools to create a cool manicure. Be sure to check out afrosec.com for more information and all the available stamp designs.